Hello, I don't know if you can see, but here in this enclosure is Wolfston. Wolfston has been ill. He hasn't been himself for about a week or so, and um, He's got diarrhoea and his abdomen is very big, he's in the hunch position and his ears are back. This could be wet tail or a digestive system failure. I've moved him from his viv into this enclosure. I'm finding it so hard to watch. He's a lovely hamster. A lovely hamster. They always used to come off and move around. And he always used to come and say hello and he used to enjoy wandering around. I'm going to the vets hopefully tomorrow. And he will um, hopefully give us some antibiotics. But if it's digestive system failure, he'll have to be put down. I'm just waiting. Waiting and hoping. Hoping that poor Wilson will get better. He's eating, he's drinking, and when I moved him, he went for me. He's he's not very well. He's not very well at all. And I'll miss him if he's gonna go. He's such a lovely hamster. A real gem. A real lovely hamster. <sighs> okay, if he has to be put down, I've got his babies and I've got Storm. I've got to be careful not to pass on this condition if his wet tail because it's passed on by bacteria on to the babies and storm um, I have got Roski dwarfs but I've read that they are unlikely to catch such a condition possible but it, it's um, it's very rare apparently Syrian hamsters digestive issues and wet tail is very common <laughs> sorry for this <sighs> sorry for this sad update So
So I'll tell you guys what's happening. You can see Wilson, the abdomen, which is, this is his face, his face is down, and the abdomen is huge. It's a common sign of a wet tail, and it's a common sign of liver failure and a twist in the digestive tract as the gut fills up with liquid I just hope you'll get better I hope you will get better I really do hope he will get better. I'll give you an update if how things go in the, the vets and what happens to him. Okay. Enough from me. Bye bye.